then um, we just went to the York County Council meeting. Um, there was three other members and me. Two of us spoke. Um, it was only two minutes, so I just went into a little spiel about um, how New Indy Paper Mill gets a generous tax deal because we all know that it's around 60% or so. Um, to bring business to this area and that in the agreement it states that it would benefit the general welfare of the public and that is actually not happening um, unfortunately. Um, I went into how they refuse to upgrade their equipment even though they should be able to um, afford to with their tax deal um, since they're saving so much on taxes. Um, and then I also touched base on the trim condenser. Um, you know, they don't want to upgrade their equipment. They want to recondition part of it in hopes that it increases the capacity of the stripping equipment um, instead of just upgrading and buying a new one or buying a second one to handle, you know, 400 and 400 gallons or so approximately. Um, so I just, you know, left it as I didn't feel like they deserve to have a philo um, in place, which is a fee in lieu of taxes. Um, and they also get a 4% homeowner's tax. Um, so there's a couple things going on with their taxes there. Um, until that they fix this because they're poisoning 1.5 million people with their toxic air emissions. Um, and that's all I said. The other group member that went up did more of an impact. Um, she did get emotional, um, which is fine. She should be able to do that. Um, because it's affecting all of us. So she kind of touched base on more of the heartstring side and I kind of did more of the logical, why are we allowing this side? Um, I do have a meeting with Christy Cox on the 20th, um, this Friday. I'm going to get everything printed out, fine tooth comb it. And then, um, I will meet with her and we'll see where, where this goes. Um, you know, if there's something where they can rescind theirs, you know, we'll look into what the process is. I'm sure there's, you know, a yay or nay with the board members there's probably you know a hearing if if new indy does something you know if it, if it gets that far so let's just kind of wait and see how friday goes um today went really well i'll be on wcnc either later tonight or tomorrow just because we filmed at 5 30 right in front of the um york county building so um that all went well um and then Wednesday guys um, we got a hurricane coming in so I think we're gonna have to probably postpone the um, DHEC protest um, I'll reach out to some of you I know um, treetops we have a lot of people that aren't on Facebook so I'll reach out to some of our um, leaders in in the areas of those that I know you guys were gonna show and attend and support um, if it's downpouring, please don't come. I won't be there if it's downpouring. I don't expect anybody to sit out in, you know, the residual effects of a of a hurricane. So, um, anyways, tonight went really well. Um, I was really happy. Look for that news article. Um, and that's it. All right, guys. Have a good night.